What up, everybody? It's your boy, Young Fizz, and welcome back to another tutorial. Today, we're going to go ahead and show you guys how to remove an annoying frequency from a recording. So without further ado, let's get right into it. Right here, I have a track. It's some Oz. I recorded it from my Roland keyboard, and it sounds something like this when it's all dry. And if you listen closely, you can hear that little whistle sound like it's really annoying. Just listen closely. So when I first started, I originally had it added a sample and I cut some highs out. But I noticed it still wasn't working. So what I went ahead and did was added this Q1 and I pretty much just kept sweeping around until I found the frequency. So what I did here was originally had boosted. So you find the frequency um, that, you know, that's the most annoying to you and then you cut. So I found the frequency, it was at 46.55 here and had a Q of 6.9. And then once I found that frequency, I went ahead and removed it. So as you can hear, it's still there, but it's a lot less noticeable in the mix. So when you put everything together, it sounds a little bit something like this here. So that's how you remove annoying frequencies from a mix. I want to thank you guys for watching. Be sure to hit the subscribe button, like this video, and please share it for more videos. Thank you for watching.